In these countries, young women are often sold by their families for a modest sum of money. They have little say in the matter and must wait for a foreign man willing to pay their bride price, hoping it will lead to a better life. Let's take a look at 10 countries around the world where brides are treated as commodities for sale. In Bulgaria, there's a unique bride market where young girls, often in their teens, are offered to potential husbands. This event, known as the Gypsy Bride Market, takes place in the town of Stara Zagora on the first Saturday of Orthodox Christian Lent. It's a lively gathering of the Kalyegas community, where people celebrate with dancing, music, food, and the showcasing of young brides. These girls are dressed in eye-catching outfits, adorned with heavy makeup and old family jewelry. Their mothers proudly accompany them, eager to see their daughters reach this significant milestone in preserving their cultural traditions. The Kalayegis have followed this custom for generations, and even today, negotiations over the bride price remain a key part of the process. The price of a bride varies depending on her appearance. For instance, a girl with light-colored eyes is typically valued higher than one with brown eyes, and a woman's virginity plays a significant role in determining her worth. Virgins command a higher price and are often treated better by the families who buy them for their sons. On average, a Bulgarian bride may cost between $7,500 and $11,300, but in some cases, the price can exceed $20,000. Traditionally, the Kalayegis preferred their daughters to marry within the community. However, with the rise of technology and access to the internet, this trend is shifting and many Bulgarian women, including those from the Kalayegis, are now open to marrying foreign men. At first glance, Bulgarian women may seem reserved, but once a man gains their trust, they reveal themselves to be dependable and sincere partners. Unlike many Western women, they are unafraid to express their emotions, believing that open communication is vital for a healthy relationship. They are also adventurous and enjoy spending time with family, making them sociable and fun at gatherings. While they see men as the primary providers in a household, Bulgarian women are not materialistic. Instead, they value love, care, and emotional connection over expensive gifts. They take pride in their appearance, maintaining their natural beauty with care, and often display classic European features, looking elegant even in casual attire. What are your thoughts on Bulgaria? Share them in the comments below. China faces significant challenges regarding women, largely stemming from the country's one-child policy, which led many families to prioritize the birth of boys. Parents often preferred male children who could support them in old age, leaving many young girls and women feeling marginalized. Although the policy has since been revised, its long-lasting effects are still evident. The gender imbalance with more men than women has caused the demand for brides to soar, with families asking for substantial amounts of money in exchange for their daughter's hand in marriage. On average, the bride price in China is around $20,000, but in some provinces it can reach as high as $50,000. Compounding the issue is the concept of shengnu, or leftover women, which refers to unmarried women over the age of 27. These women who may have focused on higher education or career advancement often face societal pressure due to the limited number of available suitors. As a result, many educated or career-driven Chinese women have turned to online dating platforms to seek foreign husbands. Over the years, the number of Chinese women marrying men from abroad has surged. For example, in 2021 alone, 549 Chinese women married foreign men in Shanghai. These marriages have generally been successful, with Chinese women being known for their loyalty and dedication to their partners. Divorce rates among Chinese women marrying foreign men are strikingly low, at just 0.2%. This is partly due to their caring nature and commitment to maintaining strong family bonds. Chinese women are often raised to be excellent caretakers, making them appealing to foreign men, especially those from traditional families who may view Western women as more self-focused. Chinese women tend to have more conservative values, which makes them attractive to men seeking traditional wives. Moreover, there is a growing fascination with the beauty and exotic appeal of Asian women. Even celebrities have openly expressed their preference for Chinese partners. 
Media mogul Rupert Murdoch was married to Wendy Dong for nearly 14 years, and actor Hugh Grant was in a relationship with Tinglin Hong. Quentin Rampage Jackson has also spoken about how his Asian partners were supportive of his career, understanding his needs for both training and rest, qualities he felt his American partners lacked. Malaysia, a beautiful archipelago in Southeast Asia, is known for its stunning women. For men seeking meaningful relationships that may lead to marriage, Malaysian mail-order brides are often a popular choice. These women are not only attractive and loyal, but also carry a soft-spoken and gentle demeanor. They possess a wonderful blend of beauty and vibrant personalities. Malaysian women enjoy having fun and are generally understanding if their husbands spend time outside the home. Physically, they are typically of medium or shorter height, with dark straight hair, brown eyes, and sun-kissed skin. Even while doing simple household chores, these women take pride in looking their best. Women with Chinese heritage in Malaysia tend to be more open-minded and are particularly interested in men from Western countries. On the other hand, Ethnic Malay women are often more traditional and place great importance on their cultural values. Regardless of their background, Malaysian women make excellent homemakers and manage their families' finances well. While some women choose to pursue careers, many are comfortable allowing their husbands to take the lead. The rise of mail-order bride services has made it easier for men to connect with Malaysian women online. These platforms, which function similarly to dating apps like Tinder, allow both men and women to voluntarily participate in the matchmaking process. Premium memberships on these sites typically cost around $500, while traveling to Malaysia to meet a potential bride can cost around $2,000. Many Malaysian women turn to international dating in hopes of finding a better life abroad. The country's diverse ethnic makeup includes some disadvantaged groups, and many of these women come from poorer backgrounds. For them, marrying a foreign husband offers a chance at a brighter future. Additionally, gender inequality in Malaysia motivates these women to seek respectful, loving relationships with men from abroad, where they hope to be cherished and valued. Egyptian brides have gained significant popularity in international dating circles, particularly among those who admire Muslim culture and are drawn to the exotic beauty of Arab women. Known for their striking features, Egyptian women resemble works of art with their dark hair, captivating eyes, ranging from brown to light shades, thick eyebrows, full lips, and alluring looks. Many young Egyptian women don't rely on makeup to attract suitors, but when they do, they often use blue eyeshadow, echoing Cleopatra's iconic style. Beyond their physical beauty, Egyptian women are known for their loyalty, kindness, and passion. They excel at creating a warm, welcoming environment for their families and are often praised for their calm and gentle nature, especially when resolving conflicts. Despite their laid-back demeanor, they bring life to social gatherings, uplifting the mood and proving to be easy to talk to and non-judgmental. There are several reasons why Egyptian women are increasingly looking to marry Western men. Egyptian society remains largely patriarchal, and women are often undervalued and denied equal opportunities. Many women in the country face arranged marriages without their consent, and the economic situation is difficult for most. A large portion of Egypt's population lives below the poverty line with families often having more children than they can support. In some cases, wealthy older men from the Arabian Gulf come to Egypt seeking young brides, paying around $2,000 to the women's families. This practice, driven by financial hardship, sees fathers pushing their daughters into marriage as a way to improve their living conditions. Unfortunately, many of these unions are temporary, with Gulf men marrying young Egyptian women during short business trips only to divorce them after a few months and return to their permanent wives. For many Egyptian women, marrying a Western man offers a chance for a different life. Western men are perceived as more attentive, respectful, and affectionate, qualities that these women seek. In a society where they are often overlooked or forced into unwanted marriages, the hope of finding love and respect with a foreign husband is a source of optimism.
Latvia is known for having a significantly higher population of women compared to men. However, the overall quality of life in the country is relatively low when compared to many first world nations. Women's rights in the Baltic states, including Latvia, are often limited, leading to frequent reports of domestic violence and abuse. As a result, many Latvian women seek opportunities abroad, particularly with partners who show them respect and appreciation. Latvian women are also widely recognized for their natural beauty. They often maintain their appearance, boasting flawless skin and a strong sense of fashion. Most women in Latvia have either blonde or brown hair, typically long and luscious. They are also among the tallest women globally, making them particularly appealing to those who are interested in tall model-like partners. Despite the lower quality of life, Latvia has a strong educational system, and its women are generally well-educated, open-minded, and forward-thinking. Nonetheless, they remain family-oriented and are known for their dedication to ensuring their partners feel loved and valued. Statistically, long-term relationships with Latvian women are highly successful. Approximately 85% of the women listed on mail-order bride websites from Latvia are genuinely seeking a foreign husband. In 2023, 650 fiancé visas were approved for Latvian women, with most brides being around 26 years old. The total cost of finding a Latvian mail-order bride, including expenses like dating app subscriptions, plane tickets, visas, and accommodation, typically ranges from $4,000 to $6,000. India is one of the most culturally and ethnically diverse countries in the world, offering a wide range of opportunities for people to find their ideal partner. Many Indian women are open to marrying foreign husbands and are known for their loyalty, with divorce rates being relatively low. It's estimated that about two-thirds of Indian women marry men from other countries, and nearly 60% of modern Indian wives remain in their first marriage. India also has a high fertility rate, with women typically having more than two children on average. Like in China, women in India, especially in their mid-20s, may find it challenging to marry locally due to cultural views on age. Despite being well-educated and often fluent in English, the employment rate for women in urban areas is below 10%. This lack of job opportunities drives many women to seek better prospects abroad, often settling with foreign spouses. Discrimination against women remains a significant issue in India, with 87% of adults believing that wives should always obey their husbands. In some regions, women are even sold into marriage, with prices as low as $35. While traditional arranged marriages are still common, more modern women are beginning to step away from this practice, with cross-cultural marriages becoming more accepted within Indian families. The idea of mail-order brides is also slowly gaining traction. The cost of pursuing a relationship with an Indian bride, including subscriptions and a two-week trip to India, averages around $3,000. Indian women are often admired for their beauty, which can range from fair to brown skin, with long, dark hair and striking eyes. Their charm is often likened to the allure of Bollywood stars, with their graceful dance moves and captivating presence in traditional attire, leaving a lasting impression. Bride buying has been a long-standing tradition in South Africa, known locally as Lobola, this custom involves the groom paying the bride's family as a form of bride price. Historically, this payment was made with cattle, symbolizing wealth in South African society. In modern times, however, the practice has shifted to involve cash payments. Although the value is often still based on the number of cattle, families now receive cash equivalent to the market value of the livestock. The amount of lobola can vary, depending on factors such as the woman's age, beauty, and even height. On average, families may request around $7,000 for Lobola. Most young women in South Africa are married off by their early 20s, leaving many women in their mid to late 20s still seeking partners. Like many developing nations, South Africa offers limited opportunities for women, driving some to seek stability abroad with foreign husbands. While the country is known for its beautiful ebony-skinned women, there are also white South African women interested in moving overseas. Life in South Africa often presents numerous challenges, and women here have developed resilient and adventurous spirits, 
enabling them to adapt to any situation. Despite these hardships, South African women are known for their generosity and open-mindedness. They are welcoming to new people while maintaining strong family bonds. Many are willing to embrace traditional roles in marriage, provided they are respected and valued by their husbands. As a traditional Islamic nation, marriage arrangements in Afghanistan are typically managed by the families of the bride and groom. While the groom may have some input, the bride usually has little say in the process and is often informed by her family that she is getting married. Most of the decisions are made by the bride's father or older brother, who take charge of the lengthy wedding negotiations, covering details like the bride price, venue, and catering. The bride price is often the most critical and debated part of these negotiations. It is determined based on factors such as the woman's age, beauty, education, skills, and her family's reputation. On average, the bride price in Afghanistan is around $10,000, though it can be lower in rural areas. Unfortunately, the bride herself does not benefit from this money, as it is usually kept by her family. This is just one example of how Afghan women are often denied their rights. Domestic violence is a known issue in the country, and opportunities for women to work are nearly non-existent. Additionally, Afghanistan has been ravaged by decades of war and terrorism, making life particularly difficult for women. Despite these challenges, Afghan women are skilled homemakers and can be devoted, loving partners. Although they may appear reserved and traditional, many Afghan women harbor dreams of finding a husband who can help them escape the hardships of life in a war-torn country. While Vietnam might not be the first country that comes to mind for those seeking Asian brides, it has become quite popular among Western men. In 2019 alone, nearly 1,800 Vietnamese women entered the United States on fiancé visas. The cost of offline dating in Vietnam typically ranges from $800 to $2,000, covering expenses like flights, accommodations, and dining. There are several reasons why many men prefer to marry Vietnamese women. These women are known for their sense of responsibility and can contribute financially while also managing household duties. They are adaptable and willing to compromise when conflicts arise, making them supportive partners. Interestingly, Vietnamese women tend to favor men who are 5 to 10 years older than they are, viewing mature partners as more emotionally and financially stable, which is conducive to starting a family. Family values are paramount to these women and most aspire to have children. In terms of appearance, Vietnamese women are striking, with fair skin, slim, toned bodies, and long, glossy hair, complemented by delicate features. They take great care in their appearance and personal hygiene, often investing in cosmetic and skincare products to enhance their looks. Vietnam's complex history with Western nations has fostered a strong interest among Vietnamese women in Western culture, for many, marrying a foreign man represents an opportunity to explore this culture more deeply. However, this does not imply a lack of loyalty or a desire to exploit foreign men. On the contrary, they are known for their strong cultural values and loyalty. Moreover, Vietnamese women are well-educated. According to a 2021 report by Global Data, the female literacy rate in Vietnam stood at an impressive 98.87%. This high level of education allows them to be engaging and intelligent partners, capable of discussing a wide range of topics. South Korea is facing a significant issue with declining birth rates, as many women are choosing not to marry or have children with local men. In response, some men have turned to other countries, such as Vietnam and China, to find brides. However, in rural areas, even the cost of securing foreign wives is often too high, prompting the government to step in and subsidize these marriages in an effort to address the nation's population crisis. The growing divide between men and women in South Korea stems from several factors. The country's film and media industries tend to portray South Korean men in an idealized way, but many women are disappointed when faced with reality. This has led some men to express their frustrations on online forums, which in turn sparked the rise of feminist movements across the country. 
One of the main contributors to this gender tension is the surge in digital sex crimes. In 2018, around 2,300 cases were reported, and by 2021, that number skyrocketed to over 10,000. These incidents often involve women being filmed without consent or having private photos leaked by ex-partners. Despite this troubling environment, many South Korean women haven't given up on the idea of marriage altogether. They are simply seeking foreign partners instead of local men. In recent years, marrying foreigners has become more accepted, even encouraged by some South Korean parents who believe their daughters would be better off with men from abroad. South Korea has become increasingly welcoming to foreigners, allowing more interactions between South Korean women and Western men. The rise of international dating platforms has also played a role, with women signing up in search of respectful, equal partnerships. Subscription fees for these platforms typically cost around $1,500, while trips to meet potential partners in South Korea can exceed $6,000. There are many reasons why South Korea has become a popular destination for those seeking Asian wives. South Korean women are known for their doll-like beauty, with large eyes, soft, light skin, and well-toned bodies. They take great care of their appearance, spending substantial amounts on beauty products and cosmetics to ensure they look their best, from hairstyles to perfectly groomed nails. Despite their attention to appearance, South Korean women often remain shy and reserved, but they are also known for being funny, helpful, and kind. They are highly educated, making them ideal partners for those seeking a blend of exotic, sensual, and traditional qualities in a relationship.